Hey, what's going on, everyone? Today, I want to talk about something that kind of disappointed me. Uh, something I just figured out last night was uh, Justin Roiland, the voice actor of Rick and Morty, uh, has had some stuff going on for the last few years where um, he's been doing some bad things. He's not doing good things. He's uh, It was like a battery, domestic assault, like domestic abuse and like battery or something like that. And it's not good. And what sucks is I'm a huge fan of Rick and Morty. Uh, I enjoy the show pretty, pretty often. I, I sometimes go back through, you know, the first through fourth season uh, on Hulu and I just constantly watch it and I really enjoy it. And it sucks to see that, you know, the voice actor of the show is well, in some legal troubles, and it's not the good kind of legal troubles. You know, it'd be one thing if they were like, you know, I don't, I don't, I don't know, like scamming people. I guess it's not as bad, but you know, domestic abuse, it's not good. It's not good. Um, there are some, some reports and stuff. I'll pop up on the screen about what's been happening, and uh, yeah. So I don't want to make the seem like. You know, I hope he gets out for like selfish reasons so we can have more Rick and Morty. You know, if there if there is a true victim of domestic abuse by Justin Roiland, then I hope justice is served. You know, it kind of sucks to hear. I don't want him to be innocent because he voice acts one of my favorite shows. I want him to be innocent because he's actually innocent, but I don't believe he's actually innocent. And I do think he is going to find himself serving some serious time in jail, which, you know, it is what it is. Which probably means no more Rick and Morty for a long time for all those Rick and Morty fans. Uh, it's a sad day, you know, for all of us, I guess. But at the same time, like I said, justice needs to be served where justice is due, so... Yeah, I just, I just want to talk about that real quick. Um, I'm not going to go into a whole story about it. There's other YouTubers who are covering this. I just wanted to talk about it real quick because uh, I haven't posted in a couple weeks. And I, uh, I've i been focusing on some other videos and content I've been working on. So, uh, yeah. Just want to let you all know that, you know, what's been happening with that guy. Um, so, yeah. I'll see you guys later.